<laughs> Natural selection is not completely random. And all these stages, one by one, step by step, incrementally improve. And every improvement is the new starting place for the variations at that generation. And they come about not through any design process, not through any deliberate design. Natural selection is the blind watchmaker. Darwin's evolution by natural selection was the greatest idea anybody ever had. Uh, before Darwin came along, it seemed obvious to everyone that big complicated things like humans and oak trees had to have a, an, an explanation in terms of design. And it was a huge stroke of insight for Darwin to see that it didn't, that the laws of physics alone could produce this prodigious amount of complexity filtered through this odd process of natural selection. Um, Darwin did it by going via artificial selection. Um, everybody knew, farmers knew, horticulturalists knew, gardeners knew, that you could change a rose, you could change a cabbage uh, by just breeding. Darwin's insight was say you don't actually need a breeder, you don't need, need a human to do the breeding. Nature does it for you, survival does it for you. It's not that difficult, it doesn't require any sort of higher mathematics or anything. Yet nobody got it until Darwin and Wallace.